A good idea rarely goes out of style. Just ask some of the firms developing next generation spacecraft. Sierra Nevada, one of four winners of second round funding from NASA's commercial crew development program, based its Dream Chaser design on the HL-20 space taxi concept. That idea was developed by NASA's Langley Research Center in the 80s and 90s. Company and NASA headquarters officials came to the center in Hampton, Virginia to recognize those studies and Langley's 50-year history of lifting body research. We're proud of the work that we at NASA did on HL-20 on the lifting body concept and we're pleased that it's being utilized today. We would not be here, I would not be at this podium if it wasn't for the great work that you did. Langley engineers devised an entire plan for the HL-20. They created pilot landing scenarios for flight simulators, some of which are now adapted for newer facilities. They tested designs in wind tunnels and even built a full-scale model with the help of universities to study crew challenges. That model is at Sierra Nevada. Many of the researchers who gave birth to the HL-20 attended the recognition ceremony. We really appreciate this opportunity to, uh, to get together again and uh, the, uh, the recognition that you provided us for a job that we were excited about, we still are excited about, and quite frankly, I thought this day would never come. Also while in Hampton, NASA's Deputy Administrator Lori Garver and Chief Technologist Bobby Braun got the chance to see a new manufacturing technique developed at Langley that could revolutionize the way aerospace parts are made.